In okay, this video, we are going to do the Diadem Nova. And I'm pretty sure this is either the 19 or 20. Probably have to look it up. Diadem butt cap is up. You can tell they're up because the little outside diamonds go out. Out that way, out that way. When butt cap is up, it will say Diadem Nova on the left, Diadem on the right. Okay, but we are doing this racket. With Selenko Torbite at 50. We're going to start in the throat. Do these datum rackets watch you elevate it is a 1620 and down in the throat there's, you'll skip three grommets i believe down in the throat you skip one then you go i think you skip like seven nine and ten or something like that we're going to do three pulls on this side thread the next two mains to get this long piece of string out of the way. Seven, the throat and the head. Come back to our other side. We're going to finish this side off. Hope there's some beginner guys out there getting something out of some of these videos. They're pretty repetitious. Forget to skip grommet number seven, throat and head. We're also going to skip grommet number nine, head and throat. We're going to tie off on grommet number eight, which is the second main string on the outside. that second main string. Draw 
cross strains. We're going to start racket handle away from you. We're going to start in that second skipped grommet at the top. We're going to start under the second main string from the outside edge. Come back to the first grommet and we're going to start over this third main string. Third cross, you're going to start under outside main, finish over outside main on the other side. Pull tension on that second cross. Start under outside main. You're going to start under the outside main and finish over outside main opposite side all the way until we get to our skip at the bottom. tension, so you're not tension on the first cross, make sure leave a little gap between the clamp and your tie off grommet. We're going to tie off on grommet number six, which is the third main string. Tie a part nail or not. Now, obviously, if you're doing a one piece or uh, not a one piece, a starting knot, this is the grommet you would have started to tie it off in. I think I forget to say that in some of my videos. Alright, now we're just free to. Start weaving all the way down. Don't forget to start under, finish over. If you get to the other side, you finish under, you've got a misweave somewhere. tonight are going to be a little easier. They're all hybrids. Had a busy racket day today. summer when university is not in really don't get that many rackets this is I think I've done nine today or I will have when I finish all of them now we get starting under finishing over Keep learning the same way you start, same way you weave. If you watch all these videos and you know how I'm doing everything, then you don't have to sit here and think, whoa, do I start under over what the hell do this? You'll always be same on everything. For the most part, I really pay attention 
Anybody in town can hand me a racket and I can tell if I strung it or not. Tell from what type of knots, where the knots are, how the weave goes. changing anything yet and still start under finish over. string to keep it going the way it was okay we're to our first skip so now you are going to start over the second main string finish under second main string opposite side Your last cross will start under the third main string. We're going to tie off on the fifth grommet one one two three four five which is the fourth main string Ouch. I just stabbed my finger with that string straighten out your crosses. I've gotten where I take it off because it hurts my back to bend over. I don't have any to straighten out anyway. Alright, that is the Didum Nova. Anybody ever asked look at that? Drew blood where I stab myself with the string. Alright, Didum Nova.